Week 9, Second Malayan Emergency Communist Insurgency in Malaysia. Bailing Talks, Withdrawal of CPM to Southern Thailand. Osman China, top communist propagandist persuaded to surrender by David Stoyer. Chin Pen. Leader of the Communist Party, at the Bailing Talks in 1955. Hulu. One of the communist leaders whom he persuaded to surrender. CPM sanctuaries and infrastructure disrupted and destroyed. The lack of total masses support. Encountered difficulties in their logistics backup. CPM objectives. To establish a Communist People's Democratic Republic of Malaya, Communist Malaya. CPM's Guerrilla Army. Malayan National Liberation Army. Resurgence of guerrilla warfare in Malaysia. The 1st of June 1968, broadcast by Radio Peking to resume armed struggle. Hold high the great banner of armed struggle and valiantly march forward. This was a war the military could not win on its own, the intricate web of civil administration, police, army and civic leaders had to be woven into a cohesive whole, capable of functioning as a war-winning machine. General Sir Gerald Templer The 17th of June 1968 Marking CPM 20th anniversary of their armed struggle the MCP launched an ambush on the security forces at the Bailing Kra Road which caused 17 security forces killed in action. The Underground Activities Secret Directive Early 1968. All those cadres who are wanted by the enemy and are no longer able to remain in the open front should resolutely go underground, set up underground organization and carry on the struggle underground. Experience during first emergency the MCP cannot rely support from poor village peoples instead MCP recruited young and aggressive new members and achieved at initial stage. CPMRF 12th Regged CPMML. 8th Regged. CPM. 1983. Surrendered. 1987. CPM Operational Areas 5th Assault Unit, Parak 
6th Assault Unit, Peihang, Tanjung Malimdan Slim River in Perak. 7th Assault Unit, Kelantan and Kelantan Perak Borders. 10th Assault Unit, Kelantan. 12th Assault Unit, Perak, Jerich, Kleanant and Danalu Perak. 16th Assault Unit, Kelantan, Guamuzang. SF top brasses were assassinated Inspector General of Police. Tansri Abdul Rahman Hashim in Kuala Lumpur and Brak State Chief Police Officer. Tansri Ku Chong Kong. In Nippo. CPM Underground Organization. Food dumps were established. Propaganda campaign. Legitimate business. The United Front Activities Labour Party of Malaya, LPM Malayan People's Party, Party Rakyat Malaya PRM The United Front Organizations Tenth Regged Twelfth Regged Waves of Infiltration Stage 1, 1969-1973, the Spath AU in Kedah, 5th AU in Perak 7th and 10th AU in Kelantan. Stage 2, 1973-1975, Estb 6th AU in Pehang and 16th AU in Alu Kelantan. Stage 3, 1975 to 1980, 6th AU in Pehang expansion into Selangor and Nejeri Sembalan. ASLTGP in Peninsula. Eighth ASLT unit. Kulim, Siu Chong. 5th ASLT Unit, Erkala, Nam Yat. 6th ASLT Unit, Cameron Highland, Chong Ko. 7th ASLT Unit, Guam Yuzang, Chow Chin. 12th ASLT Unit, Hulu Parak, Chong Chip Hing. 16th ASLT Unit, Guam Yuzang, TZD Kwai Chong. Government Strategy, Countermeasures Security and Development, Kesban. Security Forces Operations Psychological Hearts and Minds Operations
Government Strategy, Economics Prosperity for the Peoples, Felder. Kajora, Johor. Katenga, Tiringanu. Kasada, Kalantan. Dara, Pahang. Jenka, Pahang. Purda, Nan. Gaida, Keda. Members of National Security Council, NSC Directive No. 1. Experience from Confrontation and First Malayan Emergency. Chairman, PM. D. Chairman, DPM. Members. Defense Minister. Minister of Home Affairs. Foreign Minister. Finance Minister. Communication Information Minister. Cord. Police Action. Cord. SF Action. Sec. Gen. Of Malaysia. CDF. IGP. Secretariat. National Security Council. State Director of Operations State Security Executive Committee deliberates and decides on action and proposals submitted by the Joint Secretariat. Joint Secretariat prepares plan, directs and supervises. District Security Executive Committees. State Departments and Federal Departments at State Level. State Police Headquarters Police Field Force Military HQ Joint Action Cord Civilian Action Cord Police Action Cord SF Action Target Kespan which is the Bahasa Malayu acronym for the words Kusalamatan, Security, and Pembanganan, Development. This concept was developed by the government with the aim of achieving national security and at the same time continuing with the national development. Kespan Area Social Economic Project and Insurgent Operating Areas Kespan Doctrine as directed in the National Security Directive No. 11 constitutes the all measures undertaken by the MAF and other government agencies to strengthen and protect society subversion, lawlessness and insurgency. Purpose, strengthen and protect society develop into a more stable and secured society. Tun Abdul Razak. The primary task of the armed forces is to fight the communists. But at the same time, they must also help implement the government's development plan this is part of the fight against the communists. Defense and development go hand in hand. Area of Operation, Sectors, Conducted by Security Forces Sector Alpha North of Perlis and part of Kedah Sector Bravo, Charlie and Delta mostly north of Kedah Sector Echo, Foxtrot and part of Gulf Fall areas north of Parak Sector Golf and Hotel in Kelantan.
Tasks of Security Forces, OPS Cota. Occupy and control strategic and important areas and routes used by CPM for movement in and out of Peninsula Malaysia. Conduct military operations and the monitoring communist activities in AOR and providing security covers to the locals against communist interference in the areas. Conduct mopping up and search and destroy operations against communist insurgents and infiltration into Kesban areas. Provide security covers to Kesban projects. Provide security to Kesban projects. Oring Asli resettlement areas at Pos Bellum, Sungai Kenarong Dan Sungai Manga di Negeri Perak. Construction of East-West Highways. Construction of Dam, Pergo, Muda, Tamunga Dan Ahning. Ops Pagar construction of fences and walls to stop smuggling's activities. Survey projects to establish marker stones at Malaysia-Thailand borders from 1973 to 1983. Military operational areas Perlis, Padang Bazaar, Bukit Kayu Hitam and Sintok Kedah, Padang Serai, Guba and Bailing Parak, Kro, Bengkalan Hulu, Kleanantan and Grik. Kalantan, Batamalintang, Jili and Guamuzang. Pehang, Rob, Kuala Lipis and Bentong. Military, Security Operations. Malaysia Thailand General Border Committee, GBCRBCO. Intelligence Operations, Military and Police. East-West Highway. Framework OPS. Attack on CT camps. Special OPS. CPM South Line Expansion Peace Agreement Peace Agreement between the Government of Malaysia Thailand and the Communist Party of Malaya in Hai on 2nd of December 1989. Reduction of Underground Capabilities 1976, Arrested and Killed 1978, No More Significant Threat 10 military operation in Sarawak. The government is ready and is capable of dealing with this threat of armed communism developing in Sarawak. It is understood that the measures that must be taken require the sustained efforts of all concerned, and the government is confident of the wholehearted support of the people. Tan, Dr. 
Ismail bin Dato Haji Abdul Rahman Deputy Prime Minister 1972. North Kalimantan Communist Party NKCP. This organization was formed in 1941 as a result of the Japanese occupation in Sarawak was known as Sarawak National Liberation League. Renamed as Sarawak Liberation League in 1952 and at the guidance of Malayan Communist Party and the main objective was to oust British rule in Sarawak. During the era of confrontation between Indonesia and Malaya, this organization joined their effort with Party Rakyat Brunei and took part in the Brunei uprising but was aborted. Reorganized a Sarawak People Guerrilla Force SPGF, in West Clementon in 1964, was led by Bonki Chuk. By the end of 1965, their members numbered more than 500 and received assistance from Indonesia. As their members grew in numbers, this organization was late known as NKCP in 1971. Failure of confrontation in Indonesia in 1965 changed the objectives of SPGF. New Govt of Indonesia refused support, SPGF and changed their objective to operate within Sarawak to conduct their armed struggle. But intense operation by security forces forced this organization to sign a peace treaty with Sarawak government in October 1973. The state government gave amnesty until July 4, 1974 for the guerrillas to surrender were only about 185 guerrillas left. The remainder, about 600 guerrillas led by Bonki Chok accepted the amnesty offered by the state government. Rajang Area Security Command, Raskom Formed in 1971, Cebu, Unified Command Structure, Military, Police and Civil Servants work together coordinate against CTs in Rajang area. General Border Committee Agreement, GBC Formed in 1972 Malaysia Indonesia Security Forces, MAF and TNI, coordinate military operations against CTs along 1,600km borders. The remainder of this movement, led by Wong Lian Kua decided to restore their bases in West Clementon in pursuing their struggle. But severe mopping up operation by Indonesian and Malaysian army resulted their complete withdrawal back to Sarawak in 1985. But no support from the peoples on their struggle. In October 17, 1990, this organization signed a peace agreement with the state government. CPM Resettlement Villages in South Thailand CPM Resettlement, 